Susie, who is 11 months and four days. four days pregnant. And as you can see, by the size of her tummy, she's going to be having quite a big baby. Rosie is 17, one hands high. And that's why she's the boss, apparently. So what we look for, she's one week off having her foal officially. She's due on the 3rd of June. But what we look for every night now is signs that that baby might be coming so we know whether to check her. So one of the first things we check, we look under here no. and we check her teats. That's right. So you can see there's a little crust of milk forming on her teats. And if you look at her legs, she has been dripping milk down her legs and that is a good sign that she's preparing there and there. no not on the front legs so boss. <laughs> this is a good sign that she's preparing for a fall to what come are those? they are her chestnuts that's not milk all horses have four chestnuts on their legs on the front and on the back so then the other thing that we do to check is with our thermometer we turn it on. Mommy, I hear them too. It's the thermometer and we pop it in their bottom, which Rosie doesn't mind at all, and then we wait. 37, 37.4, 37.6. Her normal I, temperature is 37.6. You heard it, did you? Oh, and we finished on 37.7 this time. But a few minutes ago it went to 37.8. It is a very warm day. And then we also look at their bottoms. So you can see here her bottom is starting to go longer, getting ready to try and get a fall out. But because she's had falls before, her bottom can be, is a little bit stretched out anyway. So it's not always the easiest sign. So she doesn't look quite ready. And then what's the tapping, Linda? Tell me about the tapping. Oh, that shows that the muscles uh, around the back end are relaxing and getting ready to release the fall, to widen to release the fold because the fold is quite a big thing to come out and you can see how that wobbles very wobbly so that shows that all the muscles around the back end are all starting to relax to help get that big fold out of that quite big, hole. big tummy <laughs> and out of that big tummy so who knows we will be keeping a very close eye over the next seven days and it's lovely and warm outside so it's perfect conditions to have a baby so, fingers crossed, we'll be seeing this baby soon. Hey everybody, I've just snuck down to the stables to check Rosie's temperature. I think the fall's coming tonight. We've got a much more elongated bottom today. Tap, tap, tap. She's feeling very loose. So, I'm just going to do a temperature check. Three. Four. No, no temperature change. But she's looking looser, so 